In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to take this wire and recycle it into a bracelet with beads. The wire came from um, a Chinese food carton and just simply take a whatever carton and you're gonna turn it into this. Look at this, this beautiful bracelet using the beads. Look at that. So this wire will be turned into this. Isn't that beautiful, guys? Beautiful bracelet. Reduce, reduce, recycle. So let's get to it. Using beads, you can use any kind of beads once the beads fit right through, slide right through on the wire. Okay, here so we go. what I do first, use my wires, I just loosen up here, pull this apart. You gotta use it real strong because it's kind of tight. And, sorry. This is kind of tight. You can just go like this. You gotta be careful because it breaks, but even if it breaks, just keep continuing and just go slow. Okay, you see you got a crock right here, look at that. See, it broke, but it's okay because you can always bend it back once you just have enough to put your beads. So here's some beads, right? Because on here, there's just a whole bunch of beads that I have. And I found these beads, which is not much left in it because I use it for so many things. These beads in the thrift store. It was full. Not bad. Okay, so those would be the beads I'll be using. And if I have other ones. So like I was saying, on the wire, right? We'll make sure the beads fit. See, you can see the hole is wide enough. See, it goes right on. Straighten it, bend it until you slide the bead right on. You could just use your hands until they go down to a good length, filling up however you like it. All right? For the purpose of this video, I'm just sliding different beads on it just to show you how you can use it. See, now this one is tight. Oh, see, it went on. Not bad. See? But I'm going to take this one because it's a little big because I'm trying to even them out. Let's see about this little one. There you go. Sometimes it may be a little tight. And it slides right on. See that? Not bad. Look, being that this wire is thick, the larger bees are preferably better to put on them, which is okay. This is too tight, so it's cracking. And that's because these bees wasn't clean from the inside when they were done. Look at that, guys. The, and the brace is formed. So as you go, you just bend. And then you bend it around. And you just keep putting your beads on. Look at that. You see how it's forming, guys? Mm hmm It is so far forming. You just straighten it out with your hand. Taking it right from your Chinese food carton. I'll show you the picture in a minute. You see how it's forming? There you go. You can actually wear the earring too. She took off back some. Okay, this little tiny one fits. It's coming along. Look at that. Alright, so put the next one on. And that's it for now with Dixie. And then all you would do, it's still got a little length, so I'm not gonna put anything. I'm gonna just do this. It's gonna be a little size, so all you do, you just close it back. Bake, it, it could be a little smaller, but and then you just do this just a little twist, a little twist right here. Oops, and then you just do that, and then you form the bracelet. Being that a little piece that came off, you can go like this, and just see the cool. See, and look at that. Bracelet created, beaded bracelet, and wire created from the 
the carton, the wire carton from a Chinese food container. Then you just slide it on. Slides right on. And that's it. Look at these two bracelets. Look at that, my friends. Isn't that? This is beautiful, guys. Look at that. Slide right off. So if you have beads in your house, hanging around, kind of hard to slide off with this one. Only because of thing, but you can always open it. See, you can always open it and just take it off. And just put it right back on, which is simple. This one is fine. See, slides right off. Look at that. Needed braces. I actually want to show you something else you can do with them. Look. You can also turn the bracelet into an earrings. Just, uh, just all you have to do is attach a jump ring and some earring hooks, earring wire. However, if it is a little heavy, you can see how it's hanging from my ears. It's a little heavy, not bad. Okay, but if you don't mind having something this heavy hang, if you don't mind having it hang, that's perfect. But it's fine. So I'm just gonna show you. All you have to do is take. So all you gotta do is take the earring, take the jump ring, push it right through, right? Just like that. Close it. Close it. Just like that. Add on the earring wire. This is stainless steel, so it's a little tight to close. And that's it. And there you have it. Put that bad boy on. A little heavy, I said, but look at that. Look at that, my friends. So, the bracelet also can be turned into some hoop beaded earrings. Isn't that cool? It's a tiny bit heavy, but not bad. Oh my god, so I'm loving this, my friends. Ow, ow, ow. Whoa. So, earring wires, beads. Beads I found at their store. You could just buy beads from Michael's Arts and Crafts. And the wire from a Chinese food container some jump rings and these are jump rings I found at Michael's and some earring wires that I found on Amazon I'll post the links in I'll post right, guys, down. that's it if you like more videos like this subscribe hit the bell for notification let me know what you think okay guys till next time just being creative here or mix it up with Jen bye bye For watching guys remember to subscribe like and share and hit the bell for notification till next time with jen just being creative bye bye